sentence of James Coddington has been carried out. The time of death is 10:16 a.m. The execution of James Coddington started on time Thursday morning in McAllister. The lethal drugs were administered at 10:02. Coddington was unconscious by 10:08, dead eight minutes later at 10:16. Witnesses said nothing seemed abnormal about the execution. It's not going to heal anything, but it closes this chapter. We're not going to be called to say, well, there's a new hearing, and there's a new trial, there's a new clemency, there's no, this is finally over. Mitchell Hale, Albert Hale's son, speaking to reporters following the execution. Coddington had been on death row for some years, convicted of murdering Albert Hale in 1997 after he had refused to lend Coddington money for drugs. Mitchell says he forgave Coddington, not for Coddington, but for himself. 25 years this thing's been going on. And, you know, after a while, you know, you just, you realize that the hatred isn't affecting him in any way, but it sure was affecting me, and I just finally had to just let it go and just, you know, I, I forgive him, uh, but that doesn't release him from, you know, the consequences of his actions. The next execution is set for October 20th for Benjamin Cole. It was supposed to be in September for Richard Glossip, but the governor issued an executive order putting a stay on that death sentence, allowing the Criminal Court of Appeals to hear more arguments on why Richard Glossop should have a chance to prove his innocence.